One of John McCain's central campaign arguments, tenets of his campaign, is eliminating earmarks, getting rid of them. You with John McCain on that? I certainly am. And, of course, the poster child for the earmarks was Alaska's, what people in the lower 48 refer to, the bridge to nowhere. Of course, it was a bridge to a community with an airport uh, in southeast Alaska. But that was excessive. And an earmark, an earmark like that, not even supported necessarily by the majority of Alaskans. We killed that earmark. We killed that project. But it's now pretty clearly documented. You supported that bridge before you opposed it. But you turned against it after Congress had basically pulled the plug on it. Do you want to revise and extend your remarks? It has on... always been an embarrassment that abuse of the ear form, ear, earmark process has been accepted in Congress and that's what John McCain has fought and that's what I join him in fighting. It's been an embarrassment, not just Alaska's projects, but McCain gives example after example after example. And now obviously, Charlie, with the federal government saying, no, w w the rest of the, the nation does not want to fund that project, you have a choice. You either read the writing on the wall and understand, okay, yeah, that, that project's going nowhere. And the state isn't willing to fund that project. So what good does it do to continue to support something that circumstances have so drastically changed? You call an audible and you deal in reality and you move on. And Charlie, we killed the bridge to nowhere and... That's the bottom line. You said you, you, you now agree with John McCain that that earmark should be eliminated. The state of Alaska governor this year requested $3.2 for researching the genetics of harbor seals, money to study the mating habits of crabs. Isn't that the, exactly the kind of thing that John McCain is objecting to? Those requests through our research divisions in fish and game and our wildlife departments and our university, those research requests did come through that system. But wanting it to be in the light of day, not behind closed doors, with lobbyists making deals with Congress to stick things in there under the public radar. That's the abuse that we're going to stop.